بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم الحمد لله رب العالمين وصلى الله وسلم على نبينا محمد وعلى آله وصحبه وسلم أما بعد ربنا لا تزيك قلوبنا بعد تهديتنا وحب لنا من لدنك رحمة إنك أنت الوحاب a beautiful dua mentioned in the Quran where Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says Rabbana la tazik qulubana O our Lord please don't allow for our hearts to be misguided you know don't close our hearts Rabbana la tazik qulubana badith hadaytana after you have given us guidance إِنَّكَ أَنْتَ الْوَحَابِ وَحَبْ لَنَا مِنْ لَدُونَكَ رَحْمَةِ إِنَّكَ أَنْتَ الْوَحَابِ You know, give us your mercy. Verily, you are Al-Wahhab, you know, the, the All-Giver. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is the most merciful, the All-Giving. He's the Almighty, He's the Creator of the heavens and earth. He's the one who provides, He's al razak He sustains us. And all of this, none of this was created in battle. None of this was created in falsehood. This is all from the Ni'amillah. All of this beauty is from the Ni'amillah. So we should reflect upon it and benefit from it. And the believer is always asking Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala for his mercy and favor. So always ask, supplicate to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Allah tabaraka ta'ala. Uh, the Prophet ﷺ said, a dua hu ibadah, that supplication is ibadah, it is worship. And because supplication is worship, we should do it often. And it's something very easy. We need Allah f- for everything. And we want so much. And Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala can give us all of that. But you have to ask Him. And you have to do those things which do not prohibit receiving his his favors and blessings and his mercy subhanahu wa ta'ala so ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala much ad'u rabbuka ad'u rabbuka alladhi khalaqa supplicate to your lord who created you and he will give you and especially in the depths of the night, and especially in sujood, as the Prophet ﷺ did, and he ordered us to do, and he gave us the example, sallallahu alaihi wasallam, to supplicate to Allah subhanahu wa taala often, supplicate to Him in the night. The Prophet ﷺ said, "Yanzilu Rabbuna tabarak wa taala kulu thulu layl al akhir, fa yaqul, min yaduni fastajib lakum, fastajib lahu, min." يَسْتَغْفِرُونِي فَغْفِرْ لَهُ إِلَىٰ آخِرَ حَدِيثِ The Prophet ﷺ said, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala descends to the lowest heaven every last third of the night and he asks, he asks the angels and he subhanahu wa ta'ala is fully aware of what we do but he asks the angels as witnesses to bear witness over us who is, you know, who is up and who is, who is uh, supplicating to me I will give them who is seeking my forgiveness I will forgive them. This is how our Lord subhanahu wa ta'ala is. But we have to make effort. We have to strive. And may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala bless us to be of those who get up in the night and who benefit from this Qiyam al-Layl during this holy month of Ramadan and supplicate to Him often. For surely we are in great need. And surely we have many sins to account for. And may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala forgive us and bless us to be of the Tawabin, wa mutatahirin, wa sabirin. May Allah bless us to be of those who rely upon Him, those who seek His forgiveness often and repent to Him, those who seek His assistance and help, and may Allah grant us all of those things.